we might have come across with the several use of Android emulators. We use Android emulators for playing Android games. We can even open any Android applications. We can use our PC to control any application or Android games with keyboard, mouse and game controllers. There are so many Android emulators available in our market. But here in this video, we will choose top 5 best Android emulators for PC. We will check the stability, performance. We will also be testing each Android emulator in this video. Coming at number 5, here we have Nox Android emulator. This is really stable Android emulator like other Android emulators. Up till now, here we have latest version 6.6.0 and it supports Android 4.4.2. This is one of the best and powerful Android emulators with so many features inside it. Like other Android emulators, it comes with built-in Play Store, so you can play all of your favorite Android games and applications. When it comes gaming, Nox is one of the most stable, smoother and fastest Android emulator in the market. Nox player has almost all of the usual features which can be selected from the right side including full screen, key set for keyboard control, multi-drive instances. Here in more we have shake option, recording, screen rotation and many others. Here in the settings icon where we can see game settings. Where we can change the frame rates of the games you wanna play. You can also get free root access in Nox player. That is really easy. Go to the settings. Go to the general settings at the top and select root and then save settings. Then Nox player will be rooted. Changes will take effect after restart. In addition you can change the theme by selecting the t-shirt icon. By this four you can change from. Nox player is absolutely free like ND, Blue Stakes or KO player. It is also available for Mac OS users. Number four we have Indie Android Emulator. This is one of the most popular Android emulator. It's been around for many years. Andy has been recently updated to Android Nougat. It has a ton of features including your phone as a controller, Mac OS compatibility, keyboard mapper and many more. One of the great feature of Andy I really like. It is safe to use than other Android emulators. It has a built-in antivirus and malware security system. It is one of the safest emulator to use. When you open Andy, the main interface will be shown to you like this. Look at the interface, it closely resembles to Android. Holding the right click on mouse will lead to this interface where you will be able to change wallpaper. You may use your favorite widgets and you will get bunch of settings options. Going back, when you click on this icon, it will show you all of the apps installed on this emulator. In addition, you can use screen rotation, key mapping, you may use your microphone, webcam and many others. If you want to use Andy for the personal use, it is absolutely free. If you want to run any business, then for a pro version, the plan started for $12 per month and for one year plan just $99. Coming at number 3 is the Blue Sticks. This is one of the most popular, stable and best Android emulator. Recently it has been updated to Blue Sticks 4. It is now being highly optimized 6 times faster than Samsung S9 Plus mobile device that runs Android OS Nougat 7.1. There has been lot of improvement in graphics seen in the updated version than the previous versions. It has mouse, keyboard, gamepad support along with ability to play Android apps side by side. Look at the quick user interface. There has been lot of improvement in graphics. This emulator has been designed to target gamers. At the app center it lists the recommended apps including popular, top grossing and trending in the right pane. At the main interface at home it will show you all of the apps that you have installed. App center for all of the recommended apps. If you are facing any problem and you need any help, you can go to the help center and type there any question whatever you want to ask. If you have a low specs PC and facing lagging while using BlueSticks, there are some useful speed up tips in BlueSticks. Go to the menu icon and in this list, click on speed up tips at the bottom and apply these actions if you are on the low specs PC. It runs multiple apps at the same time. When open any app, it opens in a new tab. BlueSticks may not run smoothly if you have old PC with lower system specs. Blue Sticks is absolutely free without any limits. But if you want to remove ads, it depends on your vision. For United States, $2 fees per month. 
Coming at number 2, we have KO Player. That is very light Android emulator. If you have low specs PC, it will better work for you. It is designed for gaming. It's really good to record your gameplay and upload it wherever you want. The user interface of KO Player is pretty good. On the left, you have several options including shake, rotation, screenshot, video recording and many others. You may also switch the screen from landscape to portrait mode. Select the rotate screen icon. You can even side loading APKs. You can select the keyboard to let you edit the keys for your keyboard. If you want to play game and using game controller, you can activate it, map it and adjust the keys to your desired layout. Like other Android emulators, it is loaded with built-in Play Store, so you can play all of your favorite games on this emulator. KO Player is absolutely free, but you may face ads like other Android emulators. Number 1 on the list we have Mimo Android Emulator. Up till now, Mimo has the latest version of 7.1.1, which sports Android 7.1.2 Nougat. It sports multiple instances. It sports multiple apps simultaneously. Mimo sports keyboard, mouse and gamepad. In Mimo, all of the usual options can be seen on the right side of it. In Mimo, you can even do multiple tasking. Click on this multi menu icon. Then new window will be open. You can click on new. Here you can pick any. It has Android 5.1, 4.4, Android 7.1 beta version and Android 7.1 64-bit. Android 7.1 64-bit is newest. So you can open that. Then it will open a new window for Mimo. So you can work more than one task at the same time. There has been a lot of improvements in graphics that can be easily seen in Mimo. The user interface is really nice in Mimo. All of the user Visual settings are on the right side of screen including full screen option, installation for external APKs. In the setting you will see bunch of settings. You can even adjust the frame rate of Mimo and many other options you can see. Thanks for watching. All of the download links are at the top pinned comment. Thumbs up if you really like this video. If I missed any android emulator in this video and you are using, let me know in the comment section so we could try out. If you are new to my channel, kindly subscribe and click the bell notification icon to get stream and tech stuff from our channel.